Welcome back. Welcome back to another Knicks post game. Knicks lose 108 to 119, go 3 and 2 in the season. Um, they competed, they competed, they fought. Uh, I mean, it's it's a loss, you know, you're not never really too happy with losses. Um, I mean, the starting five was a minus 14, minus 19, minus 22, minus 8, and minus 7. Obviously, Mitchell Robinson played 20 minutes. Foul trouble, five fouls. Again, we're fouling a lot. Um, but before I, I say anything about the game, I just want to give a big shout out to the, the, the Bucks jerseys. Them Bucks jerseys are absolutely crazy. Them bad boys, oh, them bad boys just, oh, God, dude. Them bad boys are just so clean. Shout out to those uh, the, hey, shout out to those Bucks uniforms, man. Them bad boys are crazy, crazy. Shout out to them. But um, <laughs> but besides that, let's go ahead and let's get into the game. Let's go ahead and give you guys my thoughts about it. Uh, it's Friday night, ten forty, so I'm not gonna keep you guys for too long. But team struggles shooting tonight. Obviously, Julius Randle was three for ten. Burns Simmons three for ten. Four and eight, four for twelve. Uh, RJ seven for seventeen. Uh, Jules gets to free throw line a lot. He just misses shots. Uh, but he's minus 14, three turnovers, 14 points for a rebound. So double double for him. Bryce has struggled tonight. One of his worst, one of his uh, bad games with us in, in, in the young season. Probably his worst game with us this season. Javon Carter had him, had did a hell of a job on Jalen Brunson. Drew um, Holiday, but really, Javon Carter. Since that first quarter, you just saw he was just on him, like right on rice, made it hard for him. Um, so, yeah, Brunson wasn't there. I mean, it happens. You know, going against the Bucks, a lot of people chose to win the uh, NBA Finals, but it is what it is. But, yeah, I just thought he struggled tonight, Jalen Brunson. Uh, again, some of our shot selection at times is just not great. Uh, quick run, Cam Reddish. I thought some some of his shot selections weren't great. Uh, I mean, I think it was one time he he hit the ball at at the wing, but I saw five, five six seconds. I think he missed. Um, then with Cam, at times it's just really. I think for him, it's just being consistent. Uh, that's the biggest thing for him. Uh, he needs to be just consistent with. You know, just the team stuff like that. Just, just his overall performance. Um, he's he's playing. He's playing. You know, Tibbs is gonna is gonna play him, but we just need that consistent Cam Reddish to help us out. Derrick Rose came in twelve points, five for eight, uh, four assists. I thought he played well. Uh, shout to him and quickly quickly came in as well as a plus eleven. The bench, like we saw last year, tried to bring us back, but this time, which last year we seen that they did this. This game, they just didn't. Um, even towards the end, in which the Bucks had scored for the last like four minutes, four and a half minutes, I wasn't really too concerned that, that they were going to come back. So that's that. And also, I thought Brunson made the half court shot, but apparently he did it. But, you know, the team fought, the team competed tonight. I'm not really too mad about it. Like I said, the Bucks, you know, it's been crazy. Grayson Allen had a good game. Um, only word or thing is just defense. I thought defensively, it was it was another struggle game. You know, 119 points. Yeah, it wasn't the greatest, but uh, it's fine. Happened. Like I said, still early. I'm not really going to like be too concerned, too mad about that. But early on, you really just trying to figure out how the team is going to perform in certain situations. Still trying to figure out, you know, the best lines and stuff like that. But obviously, in that third quarter, the wells started coming in. The open threes. That's what I wanted to get to right quick. The open threes. Our rotations are bad, but helping unnecessarily. The weak side is always open from three. Corner is always open from three. The corner ball is the shortest corner. It's the shortest three ball in the game. But I mean, I know they were trying to double team Giannis, but I just felt that wasn't really well. Uh, and then, like I said, don't like even go back to last season. I feel like. These unnecessary just double teams, like these co collapsing the paint, wall the paint up, leaving just open threes. I mean, the Bucks weren't making a lot. I, I, I mean, Grayson Allen made some, but 
They went 13 for 45. They went 28 per, per nine percent. So 28.9 percent. So that's something Tibbs is just gonna continue to do. You're gonna beat us. You gotta beat us. You know. You ain't getting nothing, nothing in the paint. You gotta kick it out. We're gonna close that to the best of our ability. So. I don't think that's going to change, but that's just my only concern about it because it's just wide open. But that's just how the next three-point defensive scheme is. But, um, we have UFC OB. I was really too happy seeing some of the stars coming back towards the end of the game. Uh, thought, thought the bench could have just played it out. But, got Cleveland next, I think. Cleveland on Sunday. Looking forward to it. Should be an interesting, fun game. Um, tough loss. Stay safe. See you guys later, man. Peace.